Disable these 12 Windows 10 and 11 services right now, 2024. Hey there, Windows 10 and 11 users. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into some essential optimization tips to streamline your Windows 11 experience. Before we begin, a quick disclaimer, disabling certain services can affect your system's functionality, so make sure you understand the implications of each change before proceeding. With that said, let's get started. Right-click on your PC and then select Properties. Click on System Protection. Click on Configure. Click to turn on this system protection. Click on Create. Enter the name of your backup and then click on Create. OK. Now let me show to you how to disable these 12 Windows 10 and 11 services. 1. Windows Update Service. If you prefer to manually update your system, you can disable the Windows Update service to prevent automatic updates from running in the background. Here is how you can do it. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC. And press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Windows Update in the list of services. Right-click on Windows Update and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, find the Startup Type drop-down menu. Select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click on the Stop button if the service is currently running. Click Apply. And then OK to save the changes. 2. Print Spooler Service. If you don't use a printer, you can safely disable the print spooler service to free up system resources. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC. And press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Print Spooler in the list of services. Right-click on Print Spooler and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, find the Startup Type drop-down menu. Select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click on the Stop button if the service is currently running. Click Apply. And then OK to save the changes. 3. Windows Search Service If you don't use the built-in search functionality or prefer to use third-party search tools, you can disable the Windows Search Service to improve performance. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC and press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Windows Search in the list of services. Right-click on Windows Search and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click on the Stop button if the service is currently running. Click Apply and then OK to save the changes. 4. Remote Registry Service If you don't need remote access to your registry, you can disable the Remote Registry Service to reduce security risks. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC, and press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Remote Registry in the list of services. Right-click on Remote Registry and select Properties. Select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click Apply. And then OK to save the changes. 5. Windows Error Reporting Service If you don't want Windows to send error reports to Microsoft, you can disable the Windows Error Reporting Service to improve privacy. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC. 
and press enter to open the services manager. Scroll down and locate Windows Error Reporting Service in the list of services. Right click on Windows Error Reporting Service and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, find the Startup Type drop down menu. Select Disabled from the drop down menu. Click on the Stop button if the service is currently running. Click Apply. And then OK to save the changes. 6. Diagnostic Policy Service If you don't want Windows to collect diagnostic data about your system, you can disable the Diagnostic Policy Service to enhance privacy. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC, and press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Diagnostic Policy Service in the list of services. Right-click on Diagnostic Policy Service and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, find the Startup Type drop-down menu. Select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click on the Stop button if the service is currently running. Click Apply, and then OK to save the changes. 7. Windows Biometric Service if you don't use biometric authentication features like fingerprint or facial recognition, you can disable the Windows Biometric Service to improve security. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC, and press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Windows Biometric Service in the list of services. Right-click on Windows Biometric Service and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, find the Startup Type drop-down menu. Select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click Apply. And then OK to save the changes. 8. Windows Time Service If you manually set the date and time on your computer, you can disable the Windows Time Service to prevent it from syncing with Internet Time Servers. Right-click on Start and then select Run. And press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Windows Time in the list of services. Right-click on Windows Time and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click Apply. 9. Xbox Live Auth Manager Service If you don't use Xbox Live or gaming-related features, you can disable the Xbox Live Auth Manager Service to free up system resources. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC. And press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Xbox Live Auth Manager in the list of services. Right-click on Xbox Live Auth Manager and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click Apply. 10. Xbox Live Networking Service If you don't play online games or use Xbox Live, you can disable the Xbox Live networking service to improve performance. Right-click on Start and then select Run. Type Services, MSC, and press Enter to open the Services Manager. Scroll down and locate Xbox Live networking service in the list of services. Right-click on Xbox Live networking service and select Properties. In the Properties window, under the General tab, select Disabled from the drop-down menu. Click on the Stop button if the service is currently running. Click Apply. 11. Connected User Experiences and Telemetry Service If you're concerned about privacy and don't want Windows to collect telemetry data, 
you can disable the connected user experiences and telemetry service to enhance privacy. Right click on start and then select run. Type services, MSC, and press enter to open the services manager. Scroll down and locate connected user experiences and telemetry in the list of services. Right click on connected user experiences and telemetry and select properties. In the properties window, under the general tab, select disabled from the drop down menu. Click on the stop button if the service is currently running. Click apply. And there you have it. 12 Windows 11 services that you can disable right now to optimize your system. Remember to proceed with caution and only disable services that you're comfortable with. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. See you next time.